Hello everybody, it's Mike here at Game from Scratch with some quick breaking news. Uh, Copper Cube 6 was just released, it is now available for download, and it is also up on Steam. And perhaps most importantly of all, with this release, it is now free. Um, see the asterisk on that? Well, that's because there are actually st still some premium versions available, but it now has a completely non-gimped uh, entry-level version available for download, and this is the way I think all of these engines have to go. If you're selling a commercial engine in this day and age, you need to make it uh, accessible in its complete or mostly complete form, and then upsell in some ways to get people interested. Otherwise, people just aren't going to check you out. Uh, so that is definitely an interesting development. Let's jump in and take a little bit more look so you see here it is now here up on steam copy cube 6 game engine just go ahead and download it like so uh, there are a couple of upgrades available including the professional edition and the studio edition you'll see here the pricing is 100 and 200 dollars uh, respectively so actually it's probably about 80 us and maybe 180 us uh, we'll see different pricing in one second but uh, as you can see you can go ahead and download uh, copper cube 6 game engine right now um, on the steam site uh, you'll also notice if you're interested i don't have time right now this is basically i'm just announcing the breaking news that it is now available for free uh but i do have a hands-on video with copper cube 5 i'll throw that link down below along with the uh the store link etc and this announcement link and the announcement is probably the most important part of all here is what is uh new in copper cube 6 and and then we'll look at what is free and not free so you'll see here uh changes for this release are um Post-processing effects, full FBX import with animation, new lighting system, unified colors and lighting, uh, DDS uh, support, WebGL 2 support, uh, loading screen image, uh, multi-selection, WebGL automatic pointer lock, free scale command, better wireframe mode, automatic DirectX install, um, scene metrics tool, nicer user interface, more train generation options, lots of performance improvements, updated light mapper, improved OpenGL rendering, improved WebGL font rendering, improved automatic uh, clip prevention for FPS camera children, and a preview of the D3D11 renderer. This is a coming soon feature. Now in terms of what is gated behind a paywall, oh and one other cool thing is if you bought Copper Cube 5 in the last three months, contact him and he will get you a free upgrade. So what is the difference between free and pro now? Well, the biggest one you're going to see straight away is this one. There is a splash screen. So you don't want the splash screen, you've got to buy Copper Cube. It's that simple, really. Other than that, post-processing effects are only available in uh, professional and studio, uh, video playback, uh, command line interface, and game client source code is the only real difference between professional to studio. Um, all of them have unlimited scenes now. All of them have no royalty. All of them have no revenue limits. So that's pretty uh, pretty cool here. You also get all of the same platforms across all um three different versions. So really the big one is going to be this uh, logo screen and then this game client source code. So if you're a studio and you need access to the source code, you get this version. So you're seeing you've got, there's your other different pricing tier, uh, 170 euro or 85 euro, or again, as you saw, free. And really that's about it for now. I haven't really jumped in hands-on with Copper Cube 6. This one caught me a bit off guard. This just happened today. Uh, so that was, the announcement was, yeah, today. Um, I don't know at what time, but um, this just happened. So I wanted to get the news out there. If you've never played around with Copper Cube before, I do recommend uh, checking out my hands-on video. It will give you an idea of what you're dealing with here. As you can see, these changes aren't massive. So what I wrote about earlier should still be uh, completely accurate. Um, and uh, yeah, it's it's free to start now uh, without limitation, without platform limitations, without royalties, without revenue limitations. So if you don't need post-processing effects and you don't care about a splash screen, um, you've definitely got a product you can jump into uh, today. As you see, it is available on Windows and Mac OS. Uh, sorry, Linux folks, there's nothing available for you. Uh, maybe that'll change in the future if you contact the developer. Uh, I don't know. I, I don't know the status of Linux for this particular engine but uh yeah that's it so uh copper cube is now available in a fully functional free form uh copper cube 6 has been released and head on over to steam to download it if you're interested in checking it out it's actually a pretty small download it's only about uh it's under 100 megs so if copper cube is something you've been interested in the past uh, now is a great time to go ahead and check it out all right that's it for now i will talk to you all later goodbye